Hey, graduating class of 2020. So, out of all the places I could record a personal video for you guys, here I am, standing outside with an umbrella in the rain. I wanted to do this because I'm guessing maybe this is the way you guys have felt this whole spring. Like, all your plans, all the things you wanted to do, those memories you thought you were going to get, have been rained on. It's kind of like every day someone else is raining on your parade. See, it started back in March when this whole thing got underway. First, it was schools canceled. Now, I'm going to go on a limb, and some of you thought that that was a good thing. You didn't have to get up anymore and go to school in the morning. You just had to log online in your pajamas. But then, sports got canceled. Then it got real. Then it was prom. Now, it looks like there's not going to be a real graduation. So, you guys might be struggling, feeling, why is this happening? This was not my plan. I did not choose this. I didn't want this to happen. Well, when I was thinking about you guys and I was kind of going through uh, some of the awesome pictures you guys sent in, I really realized how much you guys have been through personally in your lives already as high school seniors. Now, some of you have dealt with uh, personal strife. You've been through a lot of uh, def different medical things that you've had to overcome personally. Now, some of you have went through some, some injuries at the worst times during your senior seasons or maybe your whole team got injured and you were the only one left. And then some of you is even more serious than that. Some of you lost a very close uh, classmate that we wish we could be graduating with, but we're not. And then some of the other of you have actually lost a very close family member. See, the thing is, our parade has been getting rained on a lot longer than just right now. See, when sin entered the world, all those bad things that come with sin came with it. But you know what? You guys have persevered. You've weathered the storm. You've gotten through. Even with all those things... God was still with you, and you're still here. You're still graduating, class of 2020. And I don't want you guys to forget all that you've overcome, all that God has helped you do to weather to get to this day. So you guys are kind of fun to me. You're a fun memory um, because you guys were the first class that I remember when I came here seven years ago that were kids. Let me take you back. You guys were just sixth graders. You, the first confirmation class that I got to teach at St. John's was you guys. I remember in the church parking lot playing uh, football with uh, Dominic, the Dawsons, and Will. Uh, I, I don't even know what we learned some days, but I knew it was fun getting to know you boys and playing football. Then I remember being in the back of a school bus uh, for sixth grade field trips at St. John's, sitting in the back joking around with Tyler and Ian and Morgan and McKenna as she went by then. Now it's just Kenna. But I remember you guys so differently. I remember you just being kids when I got here. But you're not anymore. Life has definitely caused you to grow up, but I want you to know that God has been with you this whole time. You still have that umbrella, that group of people in your life that have protected you, and God that has guided you through this moment. So while it might not be what you were planning and what you hoped for, it's still the exact right thing. Because God is still with you, God still loves you, and you're going to continue to weather more storms in your future. You guys are going to be well prepared to take on this world. Now, with a lot of you... I just think it's fun looking at because I don't even call you by your regular names anymore. It's Kenna. It's Lid. It's the girls that I speak life with and sing songs. I've gotten to know you guys. I'm so excited to see where God takes you. Let me just say a quick prayer of blessing, and then I want you to check out the little video tribute next. Let's pray. God, I just want to ask you to bless these graduates. This is not the way they planned their graduation. This isn't the way they thought it would end up, God. But we know through it all, you are still with us. You bring uh, good out of everything, as it says in Romans 8. And help all these graduates remember uh, what they've been through to get where they are today. Thank you for their families that have helped guide them and pro provide that protection. And continue, God, to bless them with an umbrella, with, with people in their lives that are continue to protect them on the rainy days and just help remind them of how much they are loved. It is all in Jesus' name that we pray. Amen. So make sure to take along your umbrella. And also bring along your Bible, whether you got the hard copy or the digital, because you're going to keep needing those things in your life. And you guys are going to continue to persevere. I'm so excited to see where God.